Jesus also told his disciples to seek his kingdom and righteousness first, and all things will be given as well. Today, the Lord wants each one of us to have one master, and that is God himself. He does not want anyone to be enslaved by wealth which is temporary because it makes us slave and becomes a source of worry and anxiety. During the time of Jesus, the continuous supply of food and clothes were rare and considered a luxury. People were often worried and anxious about how to meet their needs. Therefore, Jesus puts before them three important things. First, not to worry about physical necessities because very often their entire existence was based on their needs and not on the life and body which are more valuable. Second, if God has given them life and body, He will surely provide for their needs. Therefore, they needed to learn to trust God and in His providence. Third, their priority in life should be seeking His kingdom and righteousness. Unlike the people in Jesus' time, we are no longer worried about food, clothing and shelter. There is plenty. Food, clothing and shelter are basic necessities of life. It is not wrong to work for these. Then in what way can we be wrong? If we ignore and neglect these basic needs in our life. Working day and night and then worrying over how to keep what we have and how to make more and more. Never being satisfied with what we have and coveting to have more and more, bigger and bigger. Neglecting the needs of others who have greater needs than us. Jesus also told his disciples to seek his kingdom and righteousness first and all things will be given as well. It means God will fulfill all our needs if we take care of his mission which is entrusted to us by Jesus. So how can we pursue his kingdom and righteousness? First of all, we always need to turn towards the Lord and learn to trust him and in his providence. Secondly, we need to use our God-given abilities, talents and other resources for the need of others. Thirdly, we need to imitate Jesus who is our master and follow his commandments. And as a disciple of Christ, we need to give him first place in our heart and not to wealth. <music>